Hi. I have a nine o'clock for nuclear medicine for bone scan. B R A Y. A year ago, if you'd have asked me to predict how my life would turn out today, I would have said a lot of things. I would have envisioned a lot of things. But I would have never have envisioned this. I can ride your block tonight, but you don't want that. Voices in my head say tote gats and spark that. Broke down bitch nigga, I got a hair trigger. If you was quicker, your homies wouldn't pull that nigga. But you wasn't once you see that flock of buzzards overhead circling. The end is certain, like custard at his last stand. You had to put your life in my hands to prove that you was a man. I never really had dreams, let alone nightmares. I guess that's just my way of attempting to control everything about myself, to include my subconscious. Huh. Maybe that's why I was attracted to powerlifting in the first place. But here lately, I could feel the control or at least the illusion of control slowly slipping away. There are kind of a couple areas of concern, um, which may be possible spread, but given your history of um, being an athlete, um, I have a low suspicion that it's related to the cancer. Okay. Um, and these areas are in your left pubic bone and basically your right hip area. Okay. So to be sure, um, we would recommend getting a bone scan just to make sure that these truly are kind of degenerative or sports-related um, issues and not really, um, you know, cancer-related. Okay. First place finisher is Ken Gray. Yeah. Four weeks since winning the gold in Atlanta and being diagnosed have gone by in a blur. I just about completely run out of money and had to take two part-time jobs working 65 hours a week on top of being in school full time just to make ends meet. I've been in and out of different doctor's offices more times than I have my entire life. I've had bone scans, CAT scans, my blood tested, my hormone levels checked, and become an expert on the prostate plan. Unfortunately, what I haven't had time or resources for were proper diet and training. But despite all the setbacks, I'm in Copley now, and I didn't come here to make excuses. I came here to win. Let's do this. pound squat took just about every ounce of energy I had, which was surprising because I've never been this exhausted this early in a meet. It was going to be a long day. Tell me a little more, did your father have prostate cancer? I don't know. I, I, can, I can find him and ask him, but as far as I know, I, he doesn't. 
Uh, no, not that I know of. You got brothers? I do, but I don't really talk to them that closely, so I don't know. As a reminder to myself of the importance of selecting an achievable and comfortable opening lift, my first bench press ended up being my only successful bench press the entire day. Shit these niggas never had Imagine that The day I take something so damn high tech Blow it out Plug it out Then flex Gas for air like asthmatics Grab your craftmatic This ain't a job It's a habit Not what? Shot what? Double M what? With a double A What can you say? <laughs> anyway Sometime big fish gotta roll with a the tuna They didn't know I was a barracuda You the one that made me go buck That made me change my name from not To not give a fuck What? Nigga still don't understand this heat that I bring worldwide When worlds collide, where do I reside? On the north side Three of us, three permits, no gang Must detect this rain, we still bang We still bang We never run, never run, we ride Never run, never run, we ride On the east side We never run, never run, we ride Never run, never run, we ride On the south side We never run, never run, we ride Never run, never run, we ride On the north side We never run Other than worried because I made the mistake of Googling um, bone lesions and every single thing that came up was cancer. Oh, okay. Uh, so I really want to... Well, rest assured, your bone scan is negative. Yes. All right. Okay. So currently there's no suspicion for that, that cancer has spread anywhere okay. outside the prostate. Okay. Um, so as I said, the findings on the CAT scan should probably... Even though my numbers in Copley were not spectacular, or record-breaking, or particularly memorable, they still were good enough for a first-place finish. What with everything that's going on, and everything that lies ahead, I have to constantly remind myself 
that every accomplishment, every small win amounts to a major victory, both on and off the platform, no matter how imperfect. <laughs>